I have always been intrigued and fascinated by the world and history of tattooing. I decided to look into the history and meanings behind the ancient art of tattooing for this research project. For many centuries, the art of tattooing has graced the bodies and connected souls of the oceanic people. Although it is lost as to how this tradition started, it is believed to have been going on for more than 2,000 years and is considered an ancient art form. This art form is believed to have been developed by the Polynesian people and brought to the different islands as these people sailed and settled into new places and created new cultures. Each island settlement continued with this tradition of tattoos, but each grew and changed a little bit over time. Even though the tradition started to vary with different names and some symbols, all of the islands and people had similar symbols and meanings behind them. To many, the art of receiving a tattoo was far more than decorative. Tattoos are a reflection of one's life and one's history. They often reflect one's status, identity, and their connection to the land, sea, and one's ancestors. They can be a record of one's past and showcase one's journey throughout life. They can showcase different significant events and choices that one has made. The tools used for this art form were created from sharpening down bone or shark teeth that would then be attached to a stick. Another stick called a mallet would then be used to hit the first one in a tapping pattern over and over again. The ink, or this would puncture the skin and insert the ink. The ink was traditionally made from burning candle nut and then mixing the ashes with candle nut oil, coconut water or milk, or sometimes seawater. The process to receive a tattoo, one had to visit with a tattoo master. The master would often determine the design and placement of the tattoo, as each had a significant meaning and purpose. The master would then draw the design on the body with chalk or oils. Then the tattooing would start. This was often painful and could last over several hours or even days to complete, depending on how much pain the person receiving the tattoo could handle. Then the healing of the tattoo could take up to three months to really start and up to a full year to completely heal. The placement of tattoos each had a significant meaning. The head was often connected to heaven, knowledge, and wisdom. The higher trunk of the body often meant generosity, sincerity, honor, or reconciliation. It was also seen as a place for balance between Renge and Papa, the lower trunk often represented energy, courage, procreation, independence, and sexuality. The upper arms and so so shoulders were seen as a sign of strength and bravery, often related to warriors and chiefs. The lower arms and hands were connected to creativity, creation, and the making of things. The legs and feet often represented moving forward, transformation, progress, separation, and choice. The joints on a body could be seen as union, contact, commitment, or relationships. There are many traditional designs and symbols and each have their own meaning as well. The entada are human figures and they can represent men, women, and sometimes gods. A row of them can represent the sky or a group of ancestors guarding their descendants. Shark teeth are often connected to protection, guidance, strength, and curiosity. Spearheads are often connected to warriors or the sting of some animals. The ocean is often seen as a place of rest, life, change, and continuity throughout change. The tiki are often represent semi-gods or ancestors, priests, and chiefs who become semi-gods after their passing. The tiki can often represent protection, fertility, and serve as guardians over people. The turtle is often connected to health, fertility, longevity in life, foundation, peace, and rest. It is also connected to the idea of unity and stitching together one's family. The lizard is often seen as good luck and is often connected to an animal that is believed to be able to communicate between the humans and gods. The stingray is related to protection, adaptation, gracefulness, peacefulness, agility, speed, and stealth. 
In conclusion, this centuries-old tradition was almost lost to colonization and the banning of tattooing for religious purposes. However, in more recent years, we have seen a revival of this ancient art form and tradition. Some people still practice this art form with the ancient style of tools and ink. Some prefer more modern methods and more modern designs. Either way, it is an art form that remains rich with meaning, tradition, and symbolism.